We'll be talking about tumble books, ebooks for children. To get to that page, we can scroll down on the Denver Library website. Scroll down to Digital Resources. There's tumble books, ebooks for children. Go ahead and click the link. And we have quite a few choices. We've got storybooks, read alongs, ebooks, graphic novels, nonfiction, videos, language learning, playlists, puzzle and games. So let's do some, let's look at a storybook. Here are some choices. I just clicked on See All Titles. And here's all the books. We have some books that are songs and some picture books. Most of these books are videos with little animations going along with the video. If we go to read alongs, here's some titles. Now, right here it says view by cover. I want to view by detail. Here, you will learn a little bit about the book and what reading level it is and how long it will take for the book to be read. Now, with Read Online, sometimes, because of technology not being 100% all the time, if you see the highlight and it's on the beginning of the page, you would be able to read with it. Dunces, Dunces Anonymous. Anonymous. Chapter, one. Chapter One. A Cunning, a plan. cunning plan. Josh tapped Josh a small tapped wooden small mallet on the mallet teacher's, on the teacher's desk. desk. The clock on the wall oh, read 1203. The classroom was nearly deserted. So as you can see, the highlight did not work exactly with the text. But there are some neat things you can do with tumble books. You can change the font. So if your child has troubles reading typical fonts, feel free to change it. You can also change the size of the font by making it bigger and making the spacing bigger. So with those with tracking issues may be able to read online. You can also change the colors. You can make the background black and the font whatever color you chose. Let me put that back. You can also have your child write notes. If there's a part of the book that they didn't understand or a part that they particularly liked, they can write notes on it. And then once they're done their book, they can just X out. If they like that book and want to continue reading it, they can add it to their favorites. Those were read-alongs, e-books. These are more like big chapter books because of one dixie As you can see over here, the reading level is AR, which is different than what they use at the Danville School System. Feel free to look up what this level is based on what your child's reading letter level is. Read online. There we go. So the big difference is that there is no play button and no highlighting. So you'll have to read it on your own. 
But again, you do get to change your fonts if that helps the reader. Again, here are your notes that you're allowed to have. X out of that. Graphic novels. Now, graphic novels are differently created. Here is a very popular Geronimo Stilton. This is the graphic novel version of Geronimo Stilton. Here's chapter menu, chapter one. And instead of going left and right with little arrows, this one, you have to scroll down to read it that way. And again, we're going to exit. Nonfiction. We're going to view all titles. We have a little bit of everything on here. Ooh, what is the sun? There's no reading level because it's a video. We keep going. A ticket around the world. There's a play video. Oh, sorry. There we go. Sorry. If you, and it also at the bottom of the page has suggestions. If you like that book, you might like this book. And it's a 20 minute video. Here are other videos. These videos are from National Geographic. These are great for those science people out there who want to learn a little bit more than what they do in the classroom. Language learning. These books are fully immersed language where all it is is Spanish speaking, French speaking books. Playlists. These are groups of books put together. So for instance, um, let's say you have under 10 minutes to finish a section. So you read about this. This book has only one playlist in it. Let's go back to playlists. Miss Markle, sorry, Miss Markley, hmm. um, Malarkey. This is a group of books that if you read online, this one is eight minutes, but you can continue with the next book. This one has two books in it. Puzzles and games. Some of the books have extra features that you can come here and, and play the games based on that book. That is the end of the Tumble Book Library tutorial. Have a great day, and uh, we hope that you enjoy Tumble Books.